So, um, I can explain. Hey. Hello, my name is Neil, and if you're new to the channel, if you're not so new to the channel, welcome back. As you can see from the title, I'm going to be trying out my wall products now. I have a few things. I might do a little voiceover if I have anything to say, because currently there are people in my apartment. So, um, I'm gonna just go straight and try these products. I'm gonna put it on and like do a look. Um, the look I have in mind is like a very grungy eye and then like dots all over the face. Um, because my plan is to like emulate the gem look um, on the top of my head. Jeffy Star kind of did this for his cremated collection and then one of the contestants from Instant Influencer did a update for the over final look where she put gems, black gems, so I'm going to try and emulate that. So the first thing I'm going to do is use this to prime my face. I'm going to use two things to prime, but this is, I've been priming it. Um, I'm just, I'm dying. On the screen, I'll put prices of everything. Let me turn this on because I'm going to see. Yeah. Thank you. I'm going to prime my face with this because I'm dry all up on my forehead. So. It's like cucumber. Because it's three in one prime holder, so prep, set, and refresh. Um, but that's gonna refresh my face real quick. I'm gonna have everything to put in a while, so I'm trying out wet in all the products. It's all in the back. Now, before you attack me with the fact that that's a bag from outside, um, every time me and my mom went to buy essential stuff, I went and brought little stuff for um, um, Walgreens and stuff. Also, like this primer and foundation, I already had it, so I wasn't gonna rebuy it. But yeah, um, primer I, I mean, the foundation I've worn multiple times before, so I know it's good. But um, the primer, I don't know if I like it. It's just I never really liked primers until like I tried the Porbum one. And then I tried out the milk one. So those are the ones I tend to use most, so I don't really know if I like this one. Or if I didn't like or like, because it's been in my collection for so long. But this is from Wet n Wild. It's the Face Primer Matte. So, oh, keep me a little matte. Oh, I don't even know if it's going to do anything, but I can always try. Why did I do that if I'm going to do my eyes first? I don't know. Um, but I'm going to use my concealer first. This is the Wet n Wild Photo Focus um, Concealer in Light Ivory. I've brought the one in Light Ivory before. And it always worked. Um, when I tried it the first time, a lot of people compared it to um, Tarte Shape Tape, and I can see that. Um, it's very drying, so I don't know if I'm going to like it because the first time I tried it, I didn't really like how drying it was, but we'll see. Um, but we're going to use this eyeshadow palette. This is the My Glamour Squad palette. It's from Color Icon. Now, I do have a beauty book. I'm not taking it out, but it's old. Like, I got it for Christmas a few years back. So I kind of don't want to use it because it is old makeup. I want to try out some new stuff. Um, from Wet Wild, but like the primer and foundation, like stuff like that, um, I'm gonna buy it again because it's kind of a waste of money to buy it again, especially if I'm not really into the primer. Well, I think I'm not very into the primer, I don't know yet. I've never tried this though, so we'll see. Jeez, oh, how do you open this? Wait, um, okay, so it opens like this. I thought it would open this way. That's weird. It's cool and weird, but this is the shades. Um, also, these are really cheap. So, 
later I'll just estimate how much everything would be together but I'll also put prices on the side if I haven't already. I'm trying to find a brush. A brush fell earlier <laughs> and I was debating if I really like that brush to pick it up. I picked it up anyways. No. Um, but yeah, so I'm trying to do a grungy eye. I don't know if I can really you guys can see, hopefully you can, because my camera's like straight, usually it's on the side. I'm trying different angles, my dude. Um, I could have just used the bronzer for that. I might do some more like shading type. Maybe if I use this, I've been using black a lot lately, so I'm not trying to use black, but I might end up with some black. This is a little bit better than that one, right? I don't know. I'm gonna just do that kind of like to dark in this area, that's pretty much it. So again, grungy. I keep on rubbing my nose, um, allergy season. I already have primer on my face, but I'm going to apply some more of this to help primer. That smells not up. I, I hate how it smells. I'm going to spray using this, which is the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation. When I brought it, it was like six something, so... I really like this foundation tool. Oh wait, I forgot. This is in the shade um, bronze beige. Hopefully it's focusing on me. Is it? Yes. Yeah, did it focus on this? Not on me. On, on this. Okay, it is. Is it going to focus on me now? <laughs> yes. Okay. This beauty blender is not helping this video. Usually it's not this bad. Also, it looks paler. Mm -hmm. The camera. I look like a ghost. But we're gonna try this um, concealer. I tend to go for a lighter concealer, so when I apply the powder, it looks better. But I don't know why this stuff applicator is like being weird. Is it because I'm using different dofu applicators? I don't know. This feels like the ones for lipsticks, and I'm not with it. I don't like that for like concealers. I don't know, it's just not my flavor, but we can see. Okay, so we're gonna powder it. Now I brought this powder. Like I actually had to buy this powder. I brought everything. I mean like I had to go to a different store to buy this powder, so I don't know if it works. I don't know if people like it. I did look at reviews for majority of this stuff. I just have my own reviews. I was going in like a regular consumer would, so so, like I said, it's going my girl. I brought this for going and buying essential things, so don't at me for going to the store just to buy this because that is not what has happened. Ooh, this is kind of pretty. I'm gonna like bronze and wrong brush. I'm gonna bronze and contour with this. Ooh, it's kind of pretty. I, I wanted this one because I felt like this might be my color, but it might be a little too may. We'll see. Okay, we have one. I see. 
I might have to watch. Cut this one. I want something pink. I'm gonna use this one. Last time I tried this, it was actually pretty good. I think it's a little too dark, but we'll see. Hmm? Well, we have like. So I'm gonna go back to the eyes. I'm gonna use this mascara. This is sticky one. I'm all to make a bowling mascara in very black. Pink, black. I'm using this lip liner. Um, we've seen this lip liner before. It's a brandy wipe. Brandy wine. I'm going to use some lips. Smart. Okay, so I did this off camera. I showed a little bit of it, but I didn't show everything. I went ahead and tried to fix it up by putting more concealer and stuff on it. It wasn't really working, so I ended up um, kind of like studying it with eyeshadow and this eyeshadow palette. I used a mixture of this shade and this shade together and used this brush. I also applied some liner in the inner corners. So that's what I did off camera. I'm going to do the dots. I'm going to do three dots up here, and three dots here, and then on the side, three dots here, and then three dots here. And let's see. Have those. And those. Probably not. I know this is not going well, this is Essence, I didn't want to cheat, but like, I already started doing this, so at this point, I don't want to mess up, <laughs> but, um, I'm just don't think about this. So I'm going to try and put some highlighter on certain areas of the face, so like underneath the brows. I'll try and do some of that. I don't know what to use though, I might just use this palette. This palette has been more useful than I thought it would be. That's a lot. back um i almost forgot to review the product like i'm doing a full face might as well say what's my fave right so um <laughs> so i'm gonna first just categorize what things i like the most out of everything and then i'm gonna go from least to favorite i don't really have like a least 
favorite out of everything and I should put things away because there's a lot of stuff and I can't see what I'm supposed to be reviewing. But we're back. <laughs> so right in front of me I have right in front of me I have all the products that I need to uh say if I like or not before I do that. Work. I just brought you. Man. There we go. Santa. It smells horrifying. Oh my gosh. Why do you smell that bad? But, um, geez, this focus circle is still annoying me. Anyways, but yeah, so I really like the products I got. Um, out of what I would definitely go for more, like, my number one is this one. Like, obviously, my number one is this one. And not surprisingly, or probably surprisingly, my number... The last one. My least favorite was this. And it's because of the scent. Um, also, I already knew I didn't like this, but, um, this is probably something I would not go for because of the scent. Like, it, it's still, it's, it's just not, it, I have other setting sprays that are really good. If I don't have a setting spray, I'd probably go for this, but the scent kind of threw me off, to be honest. But, you know, that's life. So, again, let's, let's actually go to the intro, outro now. I spent eight minutes reviewing these things. So. I really like the slip. I tried to slip before, but I actually like shade in that area and I don't want to do that again so I'm gonna have to look at that but I honestly really like the dots next time what I'm gonna do is actually like well if you would do this you can use gems I didn't want to get gems I was really interrupted but what I was saying is that this is the final look next time um, I'll purchase a regular liquid liner instead of felt tip if I would do this, but you can always get gems and actually glue them on, but, um, my model doesn't have lash glue nor lashes, so, uh, nor do they sell gems, I think, so this is my best bet. Um, but yeah, so this is the final look. I hope you enjoy it. Um, if you want more videos like this, please comment, or I'll just do it because I want to. But I'll see you next time.